I've been seeing a few funding options aimed at Amazon sellers. I'm thinking about getting a loan to launch my next product. Any suggestions? Uh, is a standard bank a good choice? <laughs> okay. Um, it, it depends a little bit. I mean, if you have an existing business and you're launching a new product, a, a normal bank could be totally fine. If you, you know, the, the, the people that you're banking with and you tell them, hey, you know, we're doing this much annually, we want to, you know, go out and, and fund a new product and launch it. Um, if they can see that you're successful, they may well be you know, willing to lend you some money or give you a credit line or something like that, right? Right. Okay. Um, there's also the small business administration. If you have a good business plan and you can, you know, this takes a little bit of time. It takes some, you know, some some preps and, and doing a business plan and all of that. Um, but that certainly is is an option as well, right? And uh, uh, it just takes a lot more work to do it that way. Um, yeah. And then you have. Um, if you're selling on Amazon, uh, Amazon Lending or Amazon Capital Services have been around for a long time. Um, and if they feel that um, your business is doing well and you've been in there for, I think, at least a year, um, they will just send you a, an offer saying, hey, you know, we're willing to give you a loan of this much at this percentage rate. And you know, maybe they'll do three months of, of interest only, so small payments in the beginning, and then you know you catch up and and pay it back over a year. Typically, it's a year, six months to a year, but sometimes it's eighteen months. Um, and um, an Amazon loan is is typically very fast because they know all your metrics, they 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 right. know your account. Right. So typically, it's approved the same day. <clears throat> And, um, and you get funded within a day or two, right? So that's a very fast um, way of doing it if they see that your account looks good and they, you know, they want to fund you. Um, and then there's uh, a, a number of other companies out there that provide um, specifically funding for Amazon sellers. And typically, um, they want to see somebody who has a track record. Right. You know, they want to see that there's revenue coming in because they're going to lend essentially against that either um, with just paying you early on money that you've already earned on Amazon. So instead of waiting for the two weeks, um, you get the money early. Um, in other cases, they're just going, hey, we're going to, you know, we, we want to just get paid back on a percentage of your revenue. Um, right. and, and, and they will take the money um, after you get paid. Um, so, so yeah, that's a number of options out there. And yeah, I mean, you know, so we have on, 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 in Manage My Stats, we have a page where we kind of refer you to a number of different um, um, loan or funding providers. Um, and they all have different options. So you kind of have to go in there and, and see what you qualify for, see what, you know, which kind of system you're, you're interested in. Do you want to just have a credit card where you can pay easy? Um, do you want to have advance um, use of your funds, or do you actually want to get a loan for buying new inventory or doing a marketing yeah. campaign? Yeah. From your, uh, let, let's make this a little bit more personal, right? So, from your, or I guess your opinion, your experience and your opinion, when would be a good time? A, a okay, first off, if someone is deciding that they probably want to get a loan, um, when should they consider getting a loan and and why like what would be the circumstances everything everyone's going to have different circumstances they're going to have sure. you know whatever's happening with their business at that time but what would you think would be kind of you know personally your you know what you would consider a good time or a a good spot in the business to consider getting a loan and then of course there's different types out there but like what's that kind of initial impetus that you would kind of think with so the, the, it depends on the size of the seller and, and where they're at in their, in their business life. But um, uh, typically, you don't want to start out with a loan for anything substantial. That's going to put you in trouble if you don't make the money back. So you don't want to go out there and get a hundred thousand dollar loan if you're making five thousand dollars in revenue. You know, because you're making maybe no profit or very little profit, right? Yeah. So you want to make sure that you can pay your loan back. Um, if you if you're making a hundred thousand a month or you're making a million dollars a month in sales, it's a whole different proposition. At that point, you're probably uh, interested in a loan to expand something or to handle a cash flow. If you know that you have money coming in over the next three months, but you want to launch a new product right now that's going to boost your revenue even more, and it's just a matter of when do you have access to the money. Um, 
then it's a good use. You're, you're getting somebody else's money. You're paying a, typically a low fee for these, um, and it allows you to launch something and increase your revenue. So typically, I would say um, you you want to get um, take a loan as an expansion tool rather than something that um, is is risky. Okay. Right. Yeah. Um, I have used Amazon lending uh, a number of times, and it's always been, you know, we we know that we're making sales predictably, and you know, but we want to now we want to either make a, a big inventory purchase, you know, we want to make sure that we have enough inventory for the Christmas season, that kind of thing. Um, so rather than having to now go, okay, we need to buy, you know, three containers worth of stuff, and it's going to cost, you know, one hundred and twenty thousand dollars. We don't have that on hand right now. You just get a loan for that. You handle it, you know, and over the next three months, you're paying it back, um, and it's done because you have the revenue coming in. But now you have extra inventory on hand for the Christmas season, and you make a lot more money. So right. it really should always be something that helps you make more money, um, you know, in excess of what it costs you in paying in, in interest for the loan. Awesome.